Alex, don't touch it. Now a helmet has the ability to work in multiple ways. A helmet that is constructed from materials that are way too hard will work a little like this. Whereas a helmet with an appropriate amount of give will act a little more like this. We realized that if the change in velocity could evenly take place over a larger distance, we could decrease spikes in g-forces, creating a safer impact. Introducing Nanofusion. What's cool about becoming a company that you have a reputation that you will try new things is people come to you with ideas because even though somebody might be bigger than us, um, a lot of companies aren't willing to try things like we are. So Nanofusion is a, a material that was introduced to us uh, by an Italian chemical company called Alimentus. Uh It's an acrylic based material with carbon nanotubes in it. It has full rebound capabilities. The ultimate goal is to provide a multi-impact helmet. Took, I took one helmet on our motorcycle side, I impacted 16 times in the exact same location and with no change in, in dissipation of energy. So super exciting. Nano actually distributes that energy much more efficiently than your standard EPS foam, allowing us to create a thinner and lighter helmet. When you have a smaller helmet, you have less torque forces on a oblique impact. So a smaller lever arm means less torque. You think of a bigger helmet, larger lever arm, more torque forces. In other words, if you apply the same force close to the center of gravity and further away from the center of gravity, the force applied further away will cause the object to spin much faster. Our core competency is safety innovation. We really care about what happens when you crash. So we're gonna take a look at every technology that we can and we believe in and implement it. We're not gonna wait for you know the industry to catch up. We're gonna do it.